such a drag. Every day he'd eat the same kind of food, dress the same, sit in front of the same kind of games. Yeah, he was just that kind of guy. But then one day he goes and kills us all. He couldn't even be original about the way he did it. I'm not complaining. I was dying of boredom anyway. But guess what? I will be coming back, and I'm bringing my new toys with me. There's been another homicide. I need you on the station now. Gotcha. There was another family shot to death in the same state last month and in December last year. Morning. A man used to Morning. rifle and meat cleaver to murder his entire family. In each case, the perpetrators were fathers. State police say this string of domestic homicides I'm appears sorry, unrelated, found though yet. it could be part of a larger trend More such as employment, child care, it. and other social issues facing the average family. Yes, Miss Kelly. Yes, we're working as fast as we can. Yes, sure. Um, we'll be there. Fifteen minutes. What? What? No, 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 no. We're already short on people. He said that? Another cut? Well, you can tell him to go back where he came from. Good morning, Lou. Swamped. That's what we are. We're getting four murders like this per week now, and the government's cutting our budget. I'm telling you, Jeffrey, we can't do our job this way. Well, that's why I'm here. For you. Bram's County can lend a cop or two for a neighboring town in need. So, what we're looking at? Henry Sullivan shot his family dead last night, then hung himself in the garage. Lisa Belinsky, his wife, shot in the stomach. And pregnant. Dear God! It's just getting worse. It's like the whole city is losing its mind. So what now? The husband had an acquaintance that's here and want to talk to us. He's upstairs. Let's go. What's your name, sir? Tom Sanders.
How well did you know him? We go back a long time. I can assure you, officer, this is not like him at all. Did he seem different lately? He had been down for a while after losing his job, but that was nothing new. This just came so suddenly. Any possible motives? I can't think of any. Could you tell us about... It's strange, though. It's happening everywhere now, doesn't it? All over town. Yeah, it's a real headbuster, I'll give you that. But, uh... Maybe it shouldn't surprise us. Oh, yeah? Why's that? I have been looking around me lately. The mood is different. People seem so on edge. So many have ended up on the streets recently. Economy is going through tough times. Takes more than that to start a riot like this. There could be more to it than just that. I'm sorry, exactly how did you know Henry Sullivan again? Yeah? Those photos you requested, sir. Ah, yeah, the photos of the crime scene I asked for. They're in the photo lab. We better go take a look. We'll talk later, Tom. I can hear them calling to me from hell. Forgive me, Lisa, there's a monster inside of me. Oh boy. They always write those things. I sent more info on this guy to your email. You're living in that hotel? Yeah, I'm heading there now. I'll check out the info. All right, see you later. State police say this string of domestic homicides appears unrelated, though it could be part of a larger trend such as employment, child care, and other social issues facing the average family. Hmm. Started drinking after losing his job. Wife had to work four jobs. Wait. There was a thing between the manager and her? Oh, I don't like where this is going. But why kill the children? Hmm. Two zero four eight six three. This wasn't like you, was it, Henry? <laughs> oh, what is that?
Hello? Hey, you okay? Tom? Tom Sanders? It's me, Jeffrey Harper from the station. I heard crying next door. Oh, sorry. It's okay. <laughs> this is a strange room you're renting, Tom. I got it real cheap. You're not from town, are you? Where are you from? I'm not really in the mood to talk about those things right now. I understand. I've been studying this since I came here. The flower? It's so terrible what happened to Henry and his family. Yet so strange, too. It's got me thinking, how do we identify something as a flower? Suppose you plant a flower, and it grows, and you take a seed from it, and you put that seed in the ground, the flower grows, and becomes exactly identical to the original flower. Is that new flower the same flower? Why not? You see, it's not so simple. Suppose, suppose that the Henry Sullivan that murdered his family wasn't the same Henry Sullivan that you or I knew before. Are you sure the only you is you, officer? <laughs> You're a philosophy lecturer? I teach linguistics, actually. Where? Nearby. No, really, where? Oh, you know, around. Freelancing, huh? Not uncommon these days. Hard to get a permanent job. Yes. That reminds me of a few things. Have you ever heard of the flowers? Flowers? I have looked up on this town. It has a fascinating history. Apparently the flowers was an ancient artifact connected to another world. Somehow it eventually found its way to this town. A group of people took possession of it and used it for unknown purposes. This was apparently 80 years ago. Where are you going with all this? I guess I... I guess I'm just grasping at straws. Tom, you're tired. You've been through a lot. Go to bed. Yeah, I'll... See you on the station tomorrow. That's enough work for today. Lawrence.
into the gap of the door. It's me, Henry. Henry Sullivan. I didn't do it. I didn't kill them. None of us did. I woke up two days ago. I walked down the hallway. And then, I saw me walking in front of myself. But it wasn't really me. You have got to convince the others. You have got to save me. I don't want to be trapped here. Uh... 
time, right now. Hurry up, we're waiting for you. Unbelievable. Power outage and fog all over. People seem pretty wild up. I'm turning off. Let's just hope we get there in one piece. Here we are. Let's head on inside. You know, it's funny. I had a dream about this place last night. Oh yeah? It was foggy. I stood by the window and you were talking with Jim and Charles about something. Huh. The strange thing was that it felt like there was someone else in the room. Watching us. Well, what do you know? Anyway, not much else happened. I woke up and felt exhausted for some reason. Looks like this guy was quite the boosa. <laughs> yeah, I... Sir? Yeah, what is it? It's this door. Jeffrey, come here. I suppose you don't recognize this symbol. Uh... No, I don't. What is it? I don't know what it is, but I know who's been using it. The other church. The other church? Cultists of some sort. Operating here in Silent Hill many years ago. Why would they out themselves like this? I'll go and check what that was. Sit in a room. Not in a hard room, listen to Lord Hardenbrust. Can the power of the main and shards skilled? Not of Svenja. Minbrust self will tell you from the hell. What's going on with that radio? What kind of language is that? It's Swedish, sir. You speak Swedish? I do, sir. Let's bring this back to the station. Our language expert got some translating to do. 
Close your eyes. Let your ears listen to me. Can you hear my voice? Can you hear your own soul scream? Let us choose. My voice that will sing to you today, or your tortured mind. Now, what do you choose? You can't choose. Your life, your future. Why is it so hard? The radio drama of 81 years ago has triggered. They are here on our earth. And they monitor and see everything. Don't trust anyone. Don't trust the police. They are already controlled by them. That's the way it has been for 81 years. Only the best can endure. The right, the right to become lords. So welcome to our world. Very soon, the gates to a new dimension. Write that number down. Well, Tom, two zero four eight six three. Ring a bell? You were a member of the other church. So what do you reckon? Is this the other church? Tom, police talking to you. It was a long time ago. When were you gonna tell us, Tom? I was only an initiate before I left. I didn't get to see a lot. But you saw something. Uh, the numbers were a form of communication between the higher ranks and the lower ranks. I never even got to see one of the higher ranking members. They used messengers. Where is the other church located? I'm not sure. How can you not be sure? Because we were blindfolded. Blindfolded? All initiates were. <sighs> All I remember is there, there were many entrances to the other church. All over the city. You could check the basement. Okay. But you're coming with us. Tom, this is a little silly, but I guess it can't hurt checking. Help us out here, Tom. Look behind the shelves. This is silly. I'll do it. I'm never... 
never seen that before. Tom, is this an entrance? It seems likely. Should we all go in? Wait. We don't know what's on the other side. One of us should go and scout ahead. When I draw straws, I'll go. We'll stay in contact over the radio. All right. Good luck. Be careful, Jeffrey. If you see anything dangerous, you turn back, you hear? I will move. Don't forget to run! Close your eyes. Can you hear my voice? Now, what do you choose? My voice to foresee the future, or your tortured mind? You have a right. A right to become one of us. So welcome to our world. Very soon, the gates to a new dimension will open. Is that an altar? Could this be the other church? What's this? That looks familiar. You followed me? That shape. Could that really be the flowers? You have also heard of it? Everyone who have grown up in Silent Hill have heard about the flowers. Tom Sanders talked about this thing. I think he tried to link it to the death of Henry and his family. Where is he now, by the way? In the back. Why did you leave him? That doesn't sound like a very good... Jeffrey! Jeffrey! 
Are you awake? Lou, why did you hit me? You gotta listen, you gotta listen. That wasn't me. What are you talking about? I saw you go in there. Listen, shortly after you went into the tunnel, someone snuck up behind me and muffled my mouth with chloroform. Then who? I don't know, Jeffrey. I don't know either. Where is Tom? No idea. Listen, you gotta get me out of here. There's a bunch of keys in my office on the third floor. No one are responding to radio or phone calls. The person attacking me could still be in here. Grab that plank. You'll find a proper weapon upstairs. I'll go right away.
Stand back! Stand back! That's not blue! We got him! We got him! Charles, over! Dang it! Still no signal! That must be the creature that attacked me and Lou! What are you talking about? The real Lou is trapped downstairs in the cage! Alright, we'll follow you. Lead the way! Talking to me just now? Yes. Tom. Who are you, really? I'm Tom Sanders. Who are you? I'm Jeffrey Harper. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. Why wouldn't I be? There is someone else in the room with us. Who? The person is staring at us right now. Where? Outside the screen. What are you talking about? Look toward the screen. I don't see any screen. You, the person outside the screen, I'm talking to you. Make Jeffrey look on the screen. Are you looking toward the screen, Jeffrey? Can you see anything? Who, me? 
I can't see anything in here. The other person sees us. What's your point? That other person isn't me? Exactly. It's time to leave, Jeffrey. You defeated the spawn of the flowers. This delayed the decay of Silent Hill by a little bit. What happens now? To sum it up, Henry Sullivan is sort of still alive and sort of didn't shoot his family. That makes no sense. Jeffrey, I don't get this. You were out five minutes, and when you get back, you have changed completely. Did you knock your head in the door on the way back or something? I had a revelation. Right. I think you better take the day off. We'll work on the case today. Actually, I've already been to Henry's house. You went there without telling us? I... yeah. I found out about the other church. You... you what? We need to track down the other church and get to the bottom of this. You... You have been doing a lot of investigation behind my back. 
Nobody knows where the other church is located. I have heard something about Fort Bradbury Street. Who said that? Oh, I'm new here. I just overheard you and I thought I would help. Right. Well, Jeffrey, I can see you're very hung up about this. All right. We'll check out Fort Bradbury Street. But we're going to Henry's later, no matter what. Good. Pretty long story. Did you hit your head in a door on the way back or something? As soon as we leave this basement, you're going to believe me. I doubt that. Oh my god, you're right. some clues at the other church. How come no one 
have told me about Fort Bradbury Street before. I'm sure we'll find something. <sighs> Next to the left. supposed to be the other church? Doors open. Let's head on in. Sure, the only 